Hello everyone, this is Lawrence from Green Geeks and today I'm going to show you how to install WordPress using Softaculous. To get started, you'll want to log into your cPanel account. Go ahead and click Client Login. From here, you'll notice there are two login screens. We'll ignore the second screen as that's being phased out. Enter your email address and password, then click Login to Account Manager. From here, click cPanel Login to be taken to your cPanel account. Now let's search for Softaculous using cPanel search feature. You'll see the Softaculous icon appear to the right. Click that. You'll notice WordPress is the first available option in Softaculous, but let's find it in the navigation menu. You'll see it under Blogs. Go ahead and click WordPress. Click Install to begin installing your WordPress website. Here you'll choose how your address will display in browsers. It doesn't matter which one you pick, but you should stick with that one throughout your website's life. Now I only have one domain for this account, greengeekstest.com, so I'll be using that one. You'll have your own options, however. There's a directory by default. This can be left blank to install WordPress on the actual domain, or set to something like slash blog. I'll be removing the directory for this example and install on the domain. The database name should be fine, but feel free to change it to anything else. Setting it to something like blog could help you find your blog's database in the future should you need to jump in there for any reason. Here's where you'll set your blog's title. I'll name this one Green Geeks Blog. If it's a personal blog, you could set it to something like My Blog. Now enter a description for your blog. I'll be using Sample Blog Website. This doesn't have to be permanent and could be changed in the future if you don't like it. Go ahead and scroll down to see the rest of the options. You should change the default login for security reasons. Anything works, and changing the login will protect your website from automated login attempts coming from random robots. Give your blog a strong password, try to use letters and numbers, and try to throw some special characters in the mix. Now that all your options are set, let's go ahead and install WordPress. Click Install. The bar will let you know when WordPress is ready for use. This won't take long. Click this link right up here. It'll be your website's address. And there it is, a brand new WordPress website. That's all for now. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. In future videos, I'll explore more WordPress options so you can get the most out of your blog. If you have any questions, you can contact our support department 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, or email us at support at greengeeks.com.